I came to China to work in this environmental field in 2014. Bamboo Bicycle combines a lot of things that I wanted to, to do. You get to make a, a DIY product using the natural material and you're creating a very sustainable way of transportation. Every bamboo tube is different, so every bamboo bicycle is unique. For us, it's not so easy to, to, to get the right bamboo. This kind of bamboo we get from Anji. Dimensions between like three and a half and five centimeters thickness of the whole bamboo and then the around half centimeters thickness of the wall for the bamboo. And the bamboo itself has to be dried as much as possible uh, before we put it in a bicycle. It's just change the, the, the geometry. Oh. If you need like a shorter bike, they go and we have to measure everything to, to, to the size. So this black is uh, carbon fiber. Carbon fiber is probably one of the now most used materials to connect things because it's light and super strong. If you want to have like no cables outside. We can make it hollow, then we create another small hole here. The cable goes inside and goes outside. Uh, the frame itself is around two kilograms, comparable to nice aluminium frame actually. The full bicycle weight depends on the bike parts you, you want to put on them. Uh, the bamboo bike absorbs vibration. You don't have to have this fork with the, uh, the suspension and stuff. To create a bamboo bicycle frame, it's not difficult at all. We had even kids of like 12 years old uh, finishing the workshop easily. The bamboo is the sustainable plant. You use it from food to, to construction and then also in our bicycle. It's amazing the, the strength of the bamboo and the flexibility and the beauty is it's everywhere around us, especially in China. Starting from sustainable transportation to, to using environmental material, uh, this is something which I like about the bamboo bike.